Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. And in this video, how I would spend £500 this month if I had only £500 to spend. Guys, if this sounds interested, <laughs> interested, <laughs> if this sounds interesting to you, I ain't cutting anything by the way, please drop a like, give me a subs <laughs> you know what it is. <laughs> and before I do so, <laughs> I need, what am I laughing for? I need to let you know I'm not a financial advisor. These are just my own personal opinions on the market. Please do your own research before investing any money. That being said, my words are just not coming out today, but I am not cutting nothing because I know you like it raw. I keep it real and organic. If I only had 500 pounds, now I want to switch this up every time because I want to show you different ideas as to why I would choose different coins and blah, blah, blah. Because if you missed my last video, I did a video on this already and I explained about certain coins that I would choose if I only had a hundred pounds go check that video out because this video is gonna be a little bit different because 500 pounds opens the door for me to invest into a bit more and I'm gonna explain why I chose these coins coin number one XRP and the reason I would choose XRP is because for me I need to look for coins because again if I've only got 500 pounds yeah and the reason i'm doing this is because there's probably people out there that can only afford 500 pounds and this is very real you know for the average person this is what i want to do listen the 1000s and the 10,000s, the they will all come later <laughs> but let's focus on the real stuff right now if i only had 500 pounds i would do xrp because for me xrp has not had its explosion yet and to be fair a lot of these coins haven't had their explosion yet i know cardano's come up to all-time highs so that's why i didn't choose cardano yet but actually saying that I chose it in my last one, right? Because I think it can go even higher. But I'm showing you something else, something new, something fresh. For me, XRP can still do a 10x. And I need to find coins that can make me money. And I would put £100 into, car, uh, sorry, <laughs> into XRP. So £100 into XRP would give me uh, 323 xrp i just want to show you guys if you know from other countries what 100 pound looks like in your countries <coughs> 139 dollars 115 uh, euros you know 14,876 yen 178 australian dollars you guys need to see that i think it's only right but i'm talking 100 pounds in xrp that would give me 323 xrp and if xrp was to do a 10x which i believe it's very possible you know <laughs> it went to two pounds something it's two pounds 76 wasn't it or the last one Look, let's just have a little check down here i always do this keep forgetting i think it yeah two pounds 75 pence so it can easily go back to all-time high if not surpass it some people are calling a 10 pound xrp but i'm gonna be real I'm happy for it to go to three to five pounds because if it goes to three to five pounds, I would have taken my hundred, invest, in, essentially invested it. Get my words out. I would have taken three hundred and twenty-three point six six coins, and I'm going to show you this, guys. If it went to, let's say, at the highest five pounds, I'd be happy with that. You take <laughs> well, my times. I ain't got nothing there to times. <laughs> Here we go. Three hundred and twenty-three coins. I times that by five pounds. I would make one thousand six hundred and eighteen pounds from my hundred pound investment. And I'm gonna get out my sticky note this time because I didn't do it my last one. And I want you to see. So my first one will be XRP. I would have invested a hundred pounds, and it would have gave me as as a total profit. Uh, I know this is just rough, guys. I should have written it out better, but you know, one thousand. Uh, where's the little dot thing here or that little line thing 618 pounds and i'm gonna add it up at the end so you can see second coin i don't care how many times i say it harmony harmony <laughs> harmony is going to remain on my list for 500 pounds and if i had to invest a certain amount i would put 100 pounds into harmony because there's so much potential for harmony to grow let me show you what 100 pounds would give me so that's 200 pounds so far right hold on a minute so 100 pounds into harmony i would get 5047 coins 0.95 i just call it 5047 i don't mind that because i believe that we may see a three pound price for harmony in the future that's just my personal opinion and i can't tell time guys i can't tell you when if it's not this bull run it might be the one after but we don't know it could surprise us next week same with xrp it could surprise us next week again i'm looking for coins that can potentially do a 10x burp action 
if <laughs> sorry, if I was gonna do a ten, well, if if I what we talking about, if I not me, <laughs> if Harmony was gonna do a ten X, you're looking at one uh, nineteen pence. So for me to say three pound, right? You're looking over what two hundred X. So, and that's just me personally. But actually, I'd be more realistic. <laughs> People are like, really? A three pound, really? Yes, really, guys. Because when you look at XRP, that has, <laughs> get my words out, <laughs> 99 billion to- uh, tokens. What? Yeah, it's tokens, isn't it? Total supply. C- tokens in supply, total 99 billion. And you look at Harmony of only 12 billion total supply, max supply 12 billion. It's seven times less, near enough, the supply. And in my eyes, I've said it before in other videos, if you're new watching, if a supply with 99 billion can reach three pound, almost, then a coin with 12 times, sorry, seven times less the supply, more scarce, harder to get hold of, should be able to do seven times more the price. Three times seven is 21. No, it ain't. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh my God, I'm not with it. So that's why I think how many can hit three pounds. And I think that's very realistic. So yeah, actually, let me do three pounds. Because I would take my 5,047 coins and I'd be patient enough to wait for it to go to... Uh, three pounds and then you're looking at a total of fifteen thousand pounds insane absolutely insane again it just it just depends on how patient you guys are to wait i'm calling it one the tick because the ticker for harmony is called one right so i would have invested a hundred pounds into that and you know it would have gave me if i was patient enough to wait for it to go to three pounds and then i sold there fifteen thousand uh, 141 i'm just showing you this i think this is important there's so many people that have money and they're probably thinking well how should i invest it and i'm hoping this is going to help you if it is so far drop a like bit of silence <laughs> coin number three there's no way in the world if i had 500 pounds i would not be investing in this guys bitcoin you would be silly not to have any because i said this to you guys before you need to follow the rich men. <laughs> follow the money, guys. Because that's what I'm doing. I'm following the money. He's not here anymore. Elon Musk was up here. I'm following the money. And if people like them, you know, the Elon Musks and these big com- companies are putting big money into cryptocurrency, especially Bitcoin, I need to do the same thing. I would put... Let me get Bitcoin up. Where's Bitcoin? Where is this thing? As my mum would say. <laughs> I'm not getting not even going there guys <laughs> I know you're sitting there thinking oh god she's coming 100 pounds that's how much I would put into bitcoin and you know it's going to give me 0.0029 which doesn't sound like a lot to some but it's a lot for someone that has not got none <laughs> if you know what I mean and I think it's important to have some bitcoin because if it does become the world's currency you know you could see an insane change in our infrastructure meaning the way we live because you know we might walk into shops and then see things priced in satoshis and when you're standing there trying to decide what beans to buy (laughs) which brand (laughs) and you've got that stupid woman (laughs) you know who's coming excuse me (laughs) that granny in it excuse me yeah do you have bitcoin (laughs) yeah i do how do you you do (laughs) Yeah, I do. How do you... Don't worry, young man. All I need to know is this. Do you have potatoes? <laughs> okay, now you're just going off topic. Why would I have potatoes? Potatoes! Oh, no, I'm not even going there. Guys, I'm talking too much. <laughs> oh, i got to breathe. Hold on. <sighs> okay, <laughs> what I'm saying is you should have some money in Bitcoin because if you don't, you may be missing out in the future. Uh, let's take this because, you know, if Bitcoin was to hit a million pounds like people claim, some are claiming for it to go to a million pounds, guys. And I don't doubt it because if it does become the world's reserve currency and all these billionaires are putting money in, times it by a million sometime in the future. I don't know how long it's going to take to get there. It could take another five years, but fine, I'll keep that in there. Because we're talking, what would I invest? And I'm a long-term investor. I invest between five to ten years, guys, and I'm happy with that. For me, if you want a, a, a quicker investment, then maybe look at day trading. But we are talking about investments, you know. So, two thousand nine hundred twenty-four providing Bitcoin hits a million pounds in the future, in the next five years, maybe. Who knows? So let's put this in. So BTC, right? Hold on a minute. Let me put this in. Uh, BTC. 
and I would have invested a hundred pounds and then it would have equaled providing that it goes to a million <laughs> in the future I mean to be fair guys if it was just to go to a uh, hundred thousand you can take a zero off this and then I'd be looking at 292 pounds but I gotta believe that it's gonna go to a million pounds I have to I have to believe that actually I'll be more realistic even if it just hit 500,000 because a lot of people are calling 300,000 400,000 that's more realistic let's divide this by two because if it's not a million and it's 500,000 I'd be getting 1,462 and I'm happy to actually take profits if I saw a 500k Bitcoin price let's add this 1,462 I didn't even put that little line thing did I where is it here so I'm taking a bit longer on this but I don't mind I think it's one of those ones that I can't rush fourth coin if I had to invest any money right now I would invest into Pundi X remember I only have 500 pounds guys and I said to you before on my last one if you missed it Pundi X and I'm saying it again because I believe Pundi X is still low low enough for people to get a certain amount of coins and make good value I think this could potentially do 10 or 20 or 50 X gains and you know if I can 10 X my money and turn 100 pounds into a thousand that's great for me look at the market cap 341 million you times it by 10 you're looking at roughly a 3.4 billion because essentially you just shuffle it over right and you're like 3.4 billion and if you're going to do that to the market cap you can take this and times it by 10 so that's a 10x when, it, when you see a 3.4 billion market cap it's a 10x it's possible and i feel like i'm shouting at you <laughs> I'm sorry, but what I'm saying is this: I wouldn't put a hundred pounds into Pundi X. Let's see how many coins it give me. Uh, Pundi, here we go. NPXS. I always get those words mixed up. I usually do NPSX, but NPXS. A hundred pounds in. Did I change it? Where, where was we doing that for? Messing me up. Here we go. Right, a hundred pounds would give me sixty-eight thousand nine hundred and sixty-five. Now, if you looked at my last video on Pundi X, maybe you haven't seen it. I think Pundi X could one day in the future hit 50 pence. And it, again, it might shock us this year. It might go absolutely parabolic. We don't know. But if this was to hit 50 pence, you times this by 50 pence. Let me show you what 50 pence looks like in dollars. <laughs> because it's like, what, 23? No, I'm gonna, no, 65 cents, I think. That's what I'm guessing. 50 pence is 70 cents. I think that's doable. And if it was to hit that, <sighs> game ch imagine turning a hundred pound into thirty four thousand fifty pence is very realistic guys i think i worked out 99 billion market cap was when it was going to uh 50 pence so it's very doable very very doable you'd be looking at thirty four thousand. the question is would you be willing to wait that long for it to hit that price because again if it isn't this bull market it might be the next one how patient are you to wait how how quick do you need money so because for me i'm patient i'm a very patient person i've been patient for three years four years however many years and i'm more patient to wait again so for me i would do that providing that it would definitely go to that price great and you know what i'm going to be more realistic with you even if it just went to 25 pence because it's going to be a lot quicker to get to 25 pence than 50 you could divide this by two I'm still making 17,000 guys, 17,000 uh, pounds if Pundi X was to hit uh, 25 pence. And I'll show you what 25 pence looks like in dollars. <laughs> I will show you this thing. You're looking at, oh, you are looking at a 35 cent price for uh, Pundi X. That is very doable. I'm going to add this because I think that that's very, very doable. And you know, a hundred pounds into seventeen thousand is absolutely insane. It makes me realize how early we still are into some of these crypto coins. And again, I'm showing you crypto coins that I think I'm going to call it NPXS that I think is still undervalued. And again, I've only got five hundred pounds to spend, so I've got to go with what I think I can really make a good turnover. There's plenty of great coins, and I know you're all going to drop in the comments. Ah, oh, but what about this one? Why not this one? Why not this one? Plenty of great coins. But you know what? The more money I have, the more I can spend. But I'm only going with five hundred pounds that's what i'd make that's what i would have invested a hundred pounds this is not very neat i usually make it a bit more neat you know <laughs> let's line the hundreds up so it look a bit more nice because i look a bit weird here something like that uh but yeah i only have a hundred pounds left what would i do with it how would i invest it if i only had 500 pounds guys my fifth coin i'm gonna be out of your hair in a minute <laughs> unless it's afro hair like mine <laughs> 
I'm not even going because you could put a Mars bar in there and then run away from the shop. <laughs> I've never tried. I ain't even got long hair anymore. I used to have long. Anyway, I'm talking too much. Ape swap. I would be risky. I think in life, high risk equals high reward. And I showed you what I do in my last video of 100 pounds. You can go check that. See how it's a little bit different this time because I've got a bit more money to play with. I would do ape swap. And the reason being because I think that I would take that risk in trying to make good money every single month for free. Because when you stake your bananas, I got a bit more there, like 800. But when you stake bananas, you make bananas and you make a passive income. Now, so I've got some burp going on. Jesus Christ. Let me show you how much I could make with this. Because a hundred pounds right now today, and this is oh this is dollars, so I'm gonna have to get up in dollars. Hold on, because we're looking down here, bottom left, this in dollars, right? So let's do this. What's a hundred pounds in dollars? Did I say 130 something? A hundred pounds is $139. 16 cents. I'm gonna be precise. $139. 16 cents. I have to do it in dollars. Because this shows dollars. Divide it by one dollar and 97 cents shall we say 97 cents i would get a total of 70 bananas 70.63 bananas okay now i would take my 70.63 bananas i'm gonna copy it so remember yeah actually could have called it 70 point uh, six four, it doesn't matter 70.63 bananas look at how much i would earn over a year because look at the apr right here 607 percent interest every single year I did a video on banks, cryptocurrency versus the banks. I did one on Zelica. Check it out. It's funny. It makes me laugh because <laughs> the banks offer you 0.01% interest over the year. If you're lucky, 2.5%. This is offering you 607%. This may change as well with the more people that start to stake, but I'm just showing you on average. I would take my 70.63 coins and times it by 6079 two percent i'm being precise every single year i would get 429 bananas but let me divide that by 30 days if you've not seen me do this before i'm going to show you again divide it by 30 days because i would want to know how much i'm making oh no no let me divide it by 365 days because i'd want to know how much i'm making every single day i'd be making 1.17 banana every single day that's banana and remember the price of one banana is down here one dollar ninety seven cents almost two dollars yeah, so I'm almost essentially you can say making two dollars a day, if anything more, because one point one seven, yeah, almost two dollars a day. Let's times this by one dollar uh, ninety, one dollar ninety seven, and it will show you here. I'm actually making two dollars and thirty one cents every single day. Times that by thirty, because what about, what would I be making a month? Because now I'm talking about setting up a passive income. If I've invested into my pundies. My Bitcoin, my Harmonies, my XRP. I've invested into all of that and it's great. But I'm now creating a side passive income with that investment. I would make every single month £69. I would have almost made back my £100 over two months just in just staking this coin and investing into this coin. Matter of fact, in 10 months, I would have made £690. Look, 10 months from then i would have made 695 pounds i would have made back my entire investment i would have made back my investment into pundi into bitcoin into harmony into xrp i could just sit back and chill now because i wouldn't even care if these other coins went up or down because i've made back my investment just by investing it into ape swap with the insane returns hope this is opening your mind guys because it makes me realize that you know ape swap is a DeFi coin and yes it's quite risky but again high risk equals high reward and i'm looking at these DeFi coins i start to take banana serious <laughs> because some people are like, oh, ape swap banana swap <laughs> pancake swap i don't know a bunny pancake swap all these swaps they sound funny when you listen to them but when you see the money you can make you start taking it serious and i'm taking it serious that's why you see me with 864 bananas because <laughs> i'm making a passive income every single day i mean what's this this has only been like a couple of hours what is this 14 dollars uh 14 bananas 14 bananas time 1.97 i'm going to show you what i've made right now in this video i don't do this usually but you're going to see it right now so 14.12 uh, times that by one dollar uh one dollar and 97 because i want to know what i've just made just now just chilling 
$27, just chilling. <laughs> that would pay for my egg fried rice and black bean sauce. <laughs> okay, i got to stop. Anyway, guys, those were my top five coins. I hoped it helped you. If it did, please drop a like. Give me a subscribe if you're new watching. Drop down in the comments. I want I want to know what how you would invest £500 because I'm in interested to know. Get my words out. And if you like these videos, I'm going to keep dropping more. Maybe I'll do a, a £1,000 one next. I think I should because the more money, my mind changes. Like I said, six months ago, <laughs> it would have not have been like this. But now, my God, my games are changing. Anyway, if you liked it, please give it a like. Shout out to my Patreons. I need to find you on my phone. I'm scrolling through. Hold on. Here we go. Shout out to Daniel Atkins, Toya Notary, Glenda, Cora Black, SMI Dry, Tassine Wahid, Tony Dam, Marco Costanti, Scott Vu, Jazz, Azari, Michael, AJ, Frank C, <laughs> get out, Frank C623, I got you there, and Clarence Dennison. Sorry, I'm mixing up so many people's names, but you know, it's all good. You know what I'm like. Thank you guys, and thank you all new patrons as well. I've seen you come into my patreons i really appreciate you thank you so so much if you want to become a patreon and you want to have a good strategy you know when to buy when to sell guys there's seven tiers take your pick of them all you can go through and see which one's best for you uh, but i'm gonna leave it here i hope you enjoyed this and i look forward to seeing you in my next video <laughs> my words <laughs> cheers <laughs>